Hello, my name is Corey Rogers, and I'm Associate Curator at Shelburne Museum. Today, we're visiting the studio of M.J. Davis, Paper Conservator. M.J. is working on a group of posters that will be featured in our upcoming exhibition, Circus Day in America. M.J., here we have a poster from the Four Pawn Sales Brothers Circus, depicting the velodrome, an inclined ramp that people uh, ride bicycles around at high speeds. Can you tell us a little bit about the treatment for this poster? Well, Corey, uh, this particular poster has some significant damage in prior to it being mounted to this poor quality paper support. Um, over here, you can see that the tape was put on the back of the poster prior to it being adhered to the um, overall paper support. And now we have discoloration. Um, the tear, some of the adhesive is let loose, so the tears are coming apart and they're quite fragile. Some of the first steps in getting preparing the piece for treatment is we need to test the media to make sure that it won't run when we put it into the water bath. So I put a droplet of water there to just sit for a few minutes. Um, after that, then we want to reduce any surface soiling that is on the surface. Uh, of the poster, and that's done with some grated eraser crumbs, and they get gently massaged onto the surface, and then I just clear them with a soft brush. After we surface clean the poster, the next step is to gently humidify it, and I have the poster between two layers of blotter. Um, under some plastic to just gently humidify it overall in preparation for the um, bath that we're going to do next. Here's one of the posters in the first of two water baths. Um, it was, it's gently put into the bath on a polyester support um, and then sits in here for a half an hour and that allows the soluble acids to come out of the poster and now we're going to remove it and prepare for the second bath. So the polyester support will hold the poster as we pull it up and we can let it drain and then we're going to take it over here to the blotters. Corey, can you tell me the history of this particular poster? Certainly. This is a really rare and interesting poster that depicts Barnum's collection of curiosities, featured at his American Museum in New York City. We think that this poster was commissioned in 1863, thereabouts, to um, celebrate the reopening of the museum after the first one was destroyed by a fire. This particular poster was previously treated with cheesecloth, was put on the back to mend the many, many tears that are in it. Um, what I've been doing is humidifying the poster locally and it has allowed this cheesecloth to come off. So I just very carefully cut along here and then slowly pull the cheesecloth away. It's um, always good to work in sort of small controlled areas when you're doing any kind of um, tedious work like this so that you can maintain basically control of what, it, what you're doing. You don't want to get too far ahead of yourself. So I get that pulled off, then I'm going to put on a dry piece of dry blotter for that area and weight it with a little plexi and then I'll cut this off and continue moving down the back of the poster. 